Using the point tool, we can now construct lines, construct points, and construct circles. I'll start by creating a line on the edge of the part using two points. I'll go to my construction tool now and I'll construct the line. By default, the construction tool is looking for a line through two points and I'll select my points. It doesn't matter what order I do this in. And I'm going to extend my line so that it goes off of the part. I use the point tool on the top of the part and I'll create a second line. Using my construction tool, I'll construct a line through two points. And again, I'll extend my line. I can now use my construction tool to create a theoretical intersection that's off of the part. By default, it's going to be the intersection of two lines, so I'll select both lines. And we now have a location off of the part that we could measure to. For example, if I chose this corner, I can create a distance to that point in the y-axis. I can choose the same two points and get the distance in the x-axis. And I can choose the same two points again and get a point to point dimension by unchecking both X and Y. It allows us now to move off of the part to create dimensions, finding theoretical intersections.